What is the first skin ever unboxed in CSGO? On August 14th, 2013, Valve released a historical update to change CSGO which would not only change the game forever, I would say it changed the whole gaming industry. It included 10 skin collections including some infamous skins like the Glock Fade, Desert Eagle Blaze and many more. Most of the skins were dropped to players actively playing the game but there were two exceptions. First, the Esports 2013 collection and secondly, the Arms Deal collection. From these collections you didn't just get any random skin drop, what you got was a weapon case with the option to buy a key to open it and see what's inside. Back then no one knew the odds of unboxing a rare skin and also nobody knew what's exactly behind the rare special item sign, shining in a bright gold color on the bottom right of their screens. Valve also claimed that a part of the earnings from the eSports case key will be used for the prize pool of future eSports tournaments, which I really like and I would love to see from every case honestly. Considering what we know now, the odds of unboxing a mil-spec blue skin are around 80%. Most of you would probably guess that the first skin to ever being unboxed is most likely to be a mil-spec skin. But this isn't the case. According to CSGO Float, which is the biggest database for CSGO skins to ever exist, the first knife ever getting unboxed is a gut knife vanilla. Just imagine you were the guy who unboxed the first ever knife. And now what we all here for, the first ever skin being unboxed is a... P250 Splash, a minimal wear restricted purpose skin from the eSports 2013 case. And now just imagine that one day there will be the last ever skin that has gotten unboxed in CSGO and we'll probably never know when this is going to happen but we all know it will.